What's up everyone? We're here again from Sugar Beach on our honeymoon. It's been incredible thus far, but we're gonna check out a new restaurant tonight. Where are we headed? So we're gonna head to the Palm Court, which is actually in the lobby. So it's a bar lounge that's only open in the evening time. They have like cocktails and appetizers, but we're gonna have dinner at the Cane Room, the Cane Bar, which is like Asian sushi. Nice. Inspired. So. Yeah, and our reservation's not until 8.50, it's like 7.15, so we're kind of heading on there early to get some drinks and head out. But I'm gonna start this video with kind of our afternoon activities. We spent some time at the pool, and as soon as we got back, it was pouring down rain, and we jumped in our, our plunge pool, our infinity pool out here, and I took the GoPro out there, so we got some pretty cool food, uh, pretty cool footies. So we're gonna start with that, yeah. Kick it off here with that. It is raining very hard, and we're getting in the pool. Woo! Fun the sun, everybody in the pool. Ooh, it's so nice. We kind of. All right, we're heading to dinner. We're looking classy right now. <laughs> Putting on our nice clothes tonight. So we're heading to Cane Bar? Well, Palm Court first. Okay, cool. Then Cane Bar. Yes, nice. What's the name of the spot? The Palm Court. Ooh, it's the like Palm the Court. It's like the of the Great Room. Oh yeah, which is over there. And we're starting off with two shots of tequila because vacation. Because you're crazy. Yeah. Sorry. I got you salt on the line. Yeah, I'm good. All right, you ready? Cheers. Olivia survived. Cheers. We're gonna cheers our real drinks. Let's go. All right, we pumped up the resi. We're heading in. Let me get a shot of this. Wow. Oh, it's not that big. <laughs> I thought it was the whole thing. <laughs> Thanks, babe. This is the spot. Thank y'all so much. Thank you. Appreciate it. Fancy. This is cool. Big bar over here. Really cool looking bar, too. And it's intimate yeah i'm all about this spot and it took us early an hour early oh that's cool should have gotten that california roll yes perfect wow and a moment yes that's a lot of california and some bit for the pods awesome perfect. how is the california roll yeah right i'm not even a big sushi guy it's pretty tasty i had one or two myself the edamame is pretty good i said edamame i know i said edamame like a like a gringo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is very good though. What you get there? Spicy salmon. Spicy salmon. And I got the ribs. It's um, it's two ribs. So I think we got some chicken fried rice. Oh my god. Yeah. You're gonna eat them. I'm gonna eat them. Okay. <laughs> Nothing. Yeah, pretty small portions. Quick review. Sushi was good. Sorry. I got you mid mid bite there. The ribs are all right. The portion was small. I mean, they didn't really like fall off the bone or anything. They're just all right. And then chicken fried rice was pretty average. Yeah, I would just come here for the drinks and the sushi. Yeah, maybe an appetizer spot. I don't know, chicken fried rice was not super flavorful. The flavor was good on the ribs, but I don't know, they just kind of missed the mark for me. The cane room. Would you go back? For the sushi, yes. Nice. For the drinks, yes. <laughs> for anything else, no. And we're heading down for dessert to Bayside. Yeah. Hey, the Bayside. Hey, bumping. It's sending it right now.
wacky night at Bayside. So fun. It was awesome. Did you like it? Yeah. Dance our booties off. DJ. Skills that dance and clean. <laughs> yeah, killed it. We'll see you all tomorrow for some more activities. Bye. It is the next morning. Last night got a little bit wacky down at Bayside. <laughs> it was super fun though. We were dancing it up. Had a great time. But we're heading to breakfast right now and we're hoping the weather clears up a little bit. It looks a little stormy uh, behind the mountains over here. But we're trying to have a beach day. Try some snorkeling. Yeah, snorkeling, maybe kayaking. We'll see though. Hopefully the weather holds out. So let's get into it. Just had a nice breakfast. We're actually gonna give a quick resort tour, so let's head up the hill to the lobby. This is the check-in area where we came in the first day. We left our bags over here and got an awesome rum punch. Here's the check-in area in front of us. This is where we gave our credit card, all that good stuff, got settled in. I guess waiting area for, maybe waiting for your room to be available. Nice, so, sweet. All right, heading on down the hill. This takes you towards the Great Room, Terrace Restaurant, cane bar. and the Cane Bar. There's a couple shops over here too. Little boutique shops. Mmm. Get some resort wear while you're on vacation. Mm, that's pretty cool. This is the Cane Bar. This is the Asian, Japanese inspired restaurant. Sushi, yeah, all that good stuff. Check it out real quick. Heading down to, what's this place called? The Palm Corner. Nice, great. okay. This is a cool area. If you want some beverages, I don't think they didn't have any, oh, they did have some appetizers um, before your meal at either of these two restaurants here. This is a great room ahead of us. This is the kind of formal spot. It's a little bit more, you know, fancy and upscale dining. We haven't done this yet. I'm not sure if we will exactly, but we've heard some pretty good things. Take a quick look. Got some cool outdoor seating over here as well. Oh, wow, it's really far back. That is nice. I'm sure this is an amazing spot at night for a romantic dinner. I got some crazy artwork too, wherever you're looking through here. Should the Mickey up in this other room, but unyielding metal street sign. Okay, interesting. Love some good artwork. Heading down another level to the Terrace Restaurant. This is the breakfast spot, actually. These other two restaurants that I just showed off, those are both dinner locations. And this is where we've eaten breakfast every day. You actually enter from the other side. You can really come in from wherever. They're, they are don't really care, honestly, but this is the terrace. I'll throw in some of that footage as well. The Continental Breakfast is right inside there. It's an amazing breakfast spot. A nice view of the Caribbean Sea. Talking about artwork, look at these skateboard decks. It's kind of the last thing I was expecting to see. The hot skateboards, so cool. I think there's a couple more over here, actually. Crazy. Bupa's is the grab-and-go coffee shop that I showed in my last video. You can check out the link below for that one. Woo! Heading on down to the pool. Again, there's the Terrace Restaurant with the Great Hall on top of it. The Great Room. Great Hall. Sounds like we're in Hogwarts or something. Ah, this is beautiful. Look at this freaking mountain. What really feels like something out of Jurassic Park. I feel like we're at Isla Nublar. This is the gym over here. I'll show off some play from that as well. Nice big gym, apparently recently renovated as well. So that's pretty neat. This is the Petit Piton and the Gros Piton. This is the larger of the two on the left side. And apparently this is the smaller one, but as you can see, it's literally just vertical. And they don't recommend that you hike this one, but we're actually gonna hike this one later in the week. So we'll throw in some footy of that as well. Cool. Let's go. 
pool is absolutely beautiful. Good spot. And head down to the water here for just a second, show off the beach. Sounds like they got some live music going on, maybe. Incredible. Absolutely beautiful. Let's head back out to the pool though. I think Olivia's got us a good spot. Some good seating over here. You don't need a reservation for any of these spots. It's pretty nice. Oh, I see Olivia. She's setting up. Another pool day. Oh, you don't say. Oh, yes, please. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Look how cute it is. <laughs> She's a little baby. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. This is a little baby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, so we fast forwarded to the next morning, but we are here for our couple's massage. Look, it's 120 minutes. What was it called? Romantic escape ritual. Ooh, a ritual. Hopefully we were not sacrificed to the St. Lucian gods. Oh, this is incredible. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna film because it's a massage and it's rather intimate and personal, but <laughs> we'll see. Give you some lay of the land. Wow. Oof. We're just waiting to be called back. This waiting room is awesome though. We're in a tree house. Love it? Woo. No kidding. Just finished our massage. It was incredible. Uh, there's no one here in the changing room. So I'll, I'll show this off real quick. Give you nice lockers to store all your stuff in. Huge changing area. There's a shower out back that's really nice. We rinsed off before we started our treatment. Bathroom in here. Pretty much everything you can need. And we finished off our massage with some Prosecco. All right, let's go meet Olivia. Oh, and she's not ready. This is the reception and lobby area over here. These are all the different treatment rooms in the, in the trees, basically. They're tree houses held up by telephone poles, essentially. And we were down here just around the corner. We had the best view of the ocean I think and it was so awesome Ooh, here we go how'd you like it <laughs> super good we were at the Waldorf last week in Orlando yeah you think this was better yeah yeah I would say it was on par but the setting made it that much Way better better so. <laughs> that always helps we're heading out of the treehouse though Ooh. Man, this place is awesome. That was great. Yeah. Staff is so cool. Mm -hmm. What a dope spa. Crazy entrance here. I think we're about to go check out the beach for the first time. All right. Mm. This will work. Now in our spot. Spot for the day. Ooh, this is nice. You see covers, towels. Big ass umbrella. This is sweet. Got some more rain. We're gonna work out. It's chilly. Work out. Oh, I mean, it's just It's coming down. Nice. And it's going past. And just like that, the sun is back out. <laughs> Alright, we're going for a swim, and I'm switching to the GoPro. Let's do it.
Made it back to the pool. Our favorite spot. And it's super nice out right now. Look at the yacht out there. What a day. So stressful. <laughs> yes. I'm kidding. Another rainstorm. Incredible pool day. So good. Let's have lunch. The lunch menu here is phenomenal. It's like the best in the resort. Woo! Sorry, neighbors. Say we're having a good time. <laughs> so awesome. It's Friday morning, 7 30. It's the earliest we've been up all week. Yeah. What are we doing? We're hiking the Gros Piton. Nice. Which is the easier of the two, but also <laughs> still hard. Yeah, it looks like Mount Crumpet basically, so. Yeah. We'll see how this goes. Come along with us. All right, you ready? At the base of the Gros Piton. Gros Piton, excuse me. Let's do it. Heading back down. Enjoy the piton at the top. Piton on the piton. And we're descending. There. I'll let you know how this goes. Uh, down is tough. <laughs> we're like on our butts half the time. Very difficult to tell, but this is like straight down. This is insane. God. All right, here we go. I can smell lunch. <laughs> Making it? We're halfway down. Yeah. Okay. There's the Petit Piton. Our resort's right at the bottom. Almost there. Tacos are calling my name. Almost there. Oop. Almost down. We made it. Yes. Whew. Oh yeah. Welcome back. Nice. You oh, did it. I did it. We made it. Look at that. Nice. Yeah. This went all the way up there. That is insane. On vacation. We did pretty good though. On our honeymoon, no less. Yeah, we did great. What was our final time? Three hours and ten minutes. Okay. We started around 8.20 or so. What time was it? Okay. We did good. Now we're going back to relax and drink. Have a blessed day. Straight from the hike into the pool, man. With another piton. Let's go. Best way to end it. Are you getting in the pool, man? Yes. Nice. Jump in there, man. But it feels good. Yeah. 
All right, so I just got out of the shower. Uh, it's Friday night. We've got some big plans this evening. We're heading down to the dock for a sunset cruise. This should be incredible. It's about a two and a half hour cruise. There's um, some drinks, appetizers included. It's already been a very long day, but um, we got some more to go. So stay tuned. Come along with us. It should be an amazing night. Uh, I guess the next shot will probably be from the boat. So let's get to it. <laughs> Great man! How's the vacation going, everybody? Woo! Are we having fun? Are we having fun? Which one is it? Come yeah, on! Wonderful! Welcome aboard! Yeah! Come on. They're coming for us. Coming for your booty. My punch. Missing me a punch. Be done, man. Here come the pirates. Yeah. Wow, this is sweet. Yeah. Coming back in Sugar Beach. Our bill is straight up. We back. Time for dinner. So fun. Yeah, that was awesome. 100 bucks, well worth it. How was that, Mon? Amazing. Yeah. We're doing the barbecue tonight, buffet, and it is so good. Uh, just grabbed some salad over here from Bayside. As you can see, look at all these options though. Bread, seafood. Oh my gosh. Let's see what Olivia's getting into. I'm gonna get the shrimp. Soup, mac and cheese, jalapeno, corn on the cob. Oh my gosh. Insane. Baked potato. Okay. Okay. This will play. Look at this dessert bar, sushi. Oh my god, this is incredible! More desserts, roasted turkey, just like some prime rib, a bunch of different sauces, suckling pig. It looks like you can just choose any meat and they'll throw it on the grill for you. Oh, I'm gonna get some of that steak over here. How's it? <laughs> Done good. Yeah. This is a start. Oh yeah.
tonight. Yes. Got some more desserts, and I got some more prime rib. All right, we're tapping out. Ooh, that's a good look. You had to do it on Johnny. Yeah, sorry. Maybe I'll cut it. I won't. All right, we did pretty good, pretty good. And we met some new friends. They sent us some drinks. They were tasty. I can't breathe. Well said. Friday night barbecue. How was it? Amazing. Yeah. So full. We're going back to the room. We're done, Zo. We thought we'd make it till DJ, but it's been a day. We climbed a damn mountain this morning, so I think we deserve some rest. <laughs> we'll see y'all tomorrow for the last day. Super sad, but this is our last full day here at Sugar Beach in beautiful St. Lucia. We just had an incredible breakfast. I'll throw in some of that footage here. Um, but we're gonna be so bummed to leave. We are somewhat excited to get back home to our puppy, Eleanor. Um, but it's been such a fantastic trip. We're gonna make the most of our last day. I think we might do some snorkeling. Olivia's down at the pool right now. We'll probably just be back and forth between the pool and the beach most of the day. We're kind of just gonna take it easy and chill. But uh, come along with us as we enjoy our last day here in St. Lucia. I already destroyed it. It was looking much better when we got it, but we went all out for our last day. French toast. What'd you get? Post egg on toast. Nice. And some potatoes. Last breakfast. Mm -hmm. I guess we'll eat breakfast tomorrow, but that one would be very sad. <laughs> this is delicious though. All right, shocker, we're back at the pool. Olivia just had drink number one. We're about to go snorkel. And we'll see what's out there. We've heard mixed reviews, but we got to check it out for ourselves. It's right on the other side of Bayside. Let's go. Right. Check it out. Oh, wakeboard? Is it a kneeboard? Water skis? I don't know about that. It's pretty choppy. Sign our lives away. Oh, yeah. Did you both sign? Yes. We're good. Is both on there. Going down the river. Snorkel up. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Like that. Awesome. It's yeah. The best coral and fish that seen. Yeah, it was good. I mean, literally right there. We didn't have to go anywhere. No. It's pretty sweet. Yeah. I wouldn't say it's the best I've ever done, but it was pretty damn good. Yeah. We had good gear. I mean, I, our feet were getting choked off a little bit yeah. by the flippers, awesome. but the snorkels are great and it's super easy. So, highly recommend.
we're heading out. We're all packed up. Hopefully we didn't forget anything. I've been here for an entire week, so it's starting to feel like home, but it's time that we actually go home. We gotta see our dog, um, but it's been an amazing trip. Our villa has been incredible. Um, food has been awesome. Pretty much everywhere we've eaten, we've been satisfied with. All the amenities have been perfect. The gym, pool, beach, we did a sunset cruise. We hiked the damn Gros Piton. I think we've done it all. Um, but like I said, it's time to go home. We highly recommend this resort and hopefully we can get back here at some point. But until then, thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Later.